Senator Patty Murray from Washington State, which is the state I live in, um, introduced a bill to the Senate to provide um, basically emergency paid uh, sick leave due to you know all of the craziness that's going on with the coronavirus right now in Washington State. And what do you know? A, uh, just a right wing, just nut job senator blocked it because um, it's expensive and burdensome for employers. And again, this wasn't some extreme measure of, you know, a year off of paid sick leave or emergency paid sick leave. It's only 14 days for a public health emergency that we are experiencing here right now due to the coronavirus. This is how just completely out of touch and and just wacko these conservative Republicans are and, you know, corporate Democrats as well. 14 days is not a lot. If an employer isn't able to provide, you know, their workers with paid time off or for, pay, or for emergency sick leave, for God's sakes, then, you know, they probably shouldn't be in business, in my opinion, if you're not able to provide just a very basic level of, of you know dignity with regards to this emergency sick leave to your employers and then it's like okay lamar alexander crazy nut job senator from tennessee if you're not in fa if you think it's too burdensome for the employers then the federal then the u.s government should be responsible for it we are are basically the only industrialized world that doesn't guarantee health care that doesn't guarantee paid uh, paternal maternal leave that doesn't guarantee paid sick leave that doesn't guarantee paid time off and we're just just totally totally backwards and the overton window in the u.s has just shifted so far to the right that people think this shit is normal but you talk to people who live who live in europe who had lived in europe i was canvassing with um, a person who had came to the u.s in 2012 and they were telling me about the amazing social safety net system that's in the in Sweden and all these other European countries and just how really outdated and nuts the US looks for having, you know, sitting senators fighting against giving people emergency sick leave. It's just immoral, it's disgusting and I mean Bernie's right, we need a political revolution. He's can't be using that messaging right now because he needs to appeal to the moderate um, and more conservative voters but I mean this is and again you know if Lamar Alexander gets sick he has the wealth and the resources and the opportunities to weather that just fine because he's a wealthy and powerful senator most people can't uh, 40 percent of the US population can't afford a four hundred dollar emergency expense how are they going to be able to take two weeks off from work unpaid people are going to lose their jobs people are going to lose their houses they're not going to be able to put food on the table they're not going to be able to pay rent they're not going to be able to make their car payments they're not going to be able to put gas in their car this is and this is only 14 days it's not some extreme measure again and this is the in this time of crisis this when this coronavirus pandemic is happening there's republicans in the senate like lamar alexander who would rather have people go lose their house people be able to not feed their kids not being able to you know pay for these vital human services that we all need to live and thrive he wants to keep that from people so it's just sick and disgusting and i hope if you live in uh you know tennessee you maybe think twice about voting for lamar alexander when he's up for re-election and maybe um, if there's a progressive Democrat running against them, maybe give them a look. He doesn't want anybody in the U.S. to get emergency sick leave at this, again, just this time of crisis. It's hugely, hugely um, disgusting. And kudos to um, Patty Murray for introducing this bill. Again, um, it shouldn't take the U.S. having to battle a coronavirus pandemic to get the ball rolling to provide paid sick leave for every every worker in the u.s in addition to maternal paternal leave paid time off medicare for all free college all of these things but 
hugely, hugely disgusting and immoral.